What's up Illusioneers, it's the Wizard here and today we're going to be taking a look at the Love Me deck by Theory11 in collaboration with Curtis Kullig. Taking a look at the tuck case, as you can see the Love Me deck features red metallic foils on a white linen stock. At the very front we have the red embossing of a heart and in cursive text, Love Me where the M is carefully designed to look like both an M and a heart. On the side, we have the four suits displayed along with the words Love, Bluff, Trick, Deal, Shuffle. And the other side reads the same way. At the bottom, we have the Theory 11 logo and some copyright info. And at the top, we have the four suits with the club and diamond suits being hidden under the sticker seal. And the sticker seal is a red stamp with a heart on it. And here is a quick glimpse of the back design. Now opening up the tuck case, as you can see on the inside there is the text Love Me, but the rest of the tuck is very minimal and unadorned. With this deck, you will get a Theory 11 ad card with the text Love Me at the top, and on the other side you will have the Love Me back design which is, by the way, a mirrored or two-way back. Now setting that aside, you will also get a double-backed playing card. You will get two identical jokers with the text Love Me at the end curve of each R. And setting those aside and looking at the faces of these cards, aside from the colors of the red cards, the court cards, the design of the Ace of Spades, and the design of the Ace of Hearts, the rest of the deck features a bicycle standard face design. Now taking a look at how this deck handles, the Love Me deck was printed on a casino grade stock that is slightly thicker than that of a bicycle standard. However, the two decks are just as flexible as each other, and the Love Me deck might be slightly more flexible right out of the box. That aside, the Love Me deck was printed with an embossed finish, a traditional cut, and a performance coat, which means that all around it will be good for both magic and cardistry. Also, for those of us with small hands, the borders on this deck are relatively thin, which means that there won't be any issues making this deck look good in fans and spreads.